Hey everyone, Mike here, and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be reacting to The Legend of Vox Machina. This is episode 3, The Feast of Realms. And before we get to the reaction, uh, I just want to say my first my my my, my first uh, experience with something in relation to Critical Role has been really great so far. I love the first two episodes. I absolutely love the storytelling. I love the characters. I love the voice acting. It This might genuinely actually, actually get me to, you know, get into Critical Role. If, it, if, if, if Critical Role is as fun as what I'm experiencing here, then it's something I might actually consider diving into, which could be very dangerous, possibly. But, um, but no, if you are new here, if you're new to the channel, uh, please consider subscribing. Uh, we're going to do this entire series, and I do a lot of other great shows as well. Um, and if you want to, before watching this, if you want to catch up on my first two reactions to the first two episodes of Vox Machina, there should be a card popping up in the corner there uh, for you to click on before you can watch this one. So please consider doing that as well. But yeah, I think that's it. Let's get into the reaction. All right, let's do it. The first two parts were just so freaking cool. I love that dragon. That dragon was so badass. Now, from my understanding from in the comments, you said this is where the the campaign starts? Oh. So this is Percy, right? Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh. Love the art direction so much. Ooh, ooh, no, what happened to Percy's family? Assassins? Oh, no. His whole family murdered. Ooh, what was that? What a start. Ooh, that's a plague doctor's mask, I believe. Bad dream? Is there any other kind? Hmm. That's a shame. To, to have a response like that, you know, is there any other kind? He, uh, nightmares is all he knows. That's, that's sad. <laughs> all right, let's go. This has been... Uh, I'm excited. As I said before, this show was not on my radar at all. Now I've been looking forward to each recording. Good morning. Good everybody. morning. Why is she yelling? Why is she yelling? Oh, good morning, Why is she yelling? Good morning. Aw. They are not matching her tone. Oh. Seven to two. That's a... I never agree to this stupid game. <laughs> Must... Emotions aren't meant to be... <gasps> I want to pet him. Loose once in a while. I want to pet him. I love the home they were given. This, is pla Hello? this place is awesome. From across the realm, are here to form a new security pact. Oh, yeah, our best for what, what was his name? Right. I, um, the, the two characters we were introduced to in the previous episode. Dignity. What was his name? <laughs> oh, nice. Well done. <laughs> what was his name? Silas? Five, he was just at two. Oh, yeah, that was a three pointer. You see, the rules of ball tag are as complex as they are. Ball tag. I, I, I shall brief them on royal etiquette and manners. You have my word. I had a friend. Will go wrong. I had a friend in high school who tried to play a similar game. Yeah. Ouch. The two characters were introduced in the be the end of the what's his name? What's his name? Silas? Was that his name? What are you doing? Remember what we practiced. <laughs> Reserved, be charming, protocol. Ooh. Look at Vax. Look at that dress. Just follow my lead. Damn, Sorry. that does a nice dress. Your weapons, they must be checked. Is that what's his name? Is that Matt Mercer? I think I I think I've seen Matt Mercer before. That kind of looks like him. Or if that's him. It's quite the pate. Ooh, Pike looks really looks pretty too. Look at that dress. Even Grog got dressed up. Drinks ten of them. They're not. Pike. Just a little drunk. <laughs> Who are you looking at? Oh, I love her. Doofus. What, what? You want to get freaky with me, sir? I don't even know you. You are a libertine and a cad. <laughs> and I like it. <laughs> what? 
What in the world? I just asked with a preview once. <laughs> the Isn't... White Stone. Lord Silas. Silas. Lady Delilah Briarwood. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Why is Percy... Are they involved in his family? Getting murdered? Massacred? <gasps> Dude. The, the the look on that on that gentleman's face. Percy, what's wrong? It's it's them. Whitestone was my home until those fiends took it. No way. What do you want us to do? Should we say something? Uriel. Uriel don't care. Can't. Can't give himself away. It looks like they're staying overnight. Why don't I make Ooh. myself scarce and slip into their chairs? Drama. See if I can figure out what they're up to. Sounds like a plan. Changa. Changa. Okay. My safe word's mommy. Mm. <laughs> mommy. Where's Vax? Oh, uh, yeah. he has the... Oh, space. wait, I called her Vax. Oh, She's Vox. Delightful. Sorry. Well, if you'll follow me, I'm seats for the sovereign trying to get better at the names. I kept calling her Vet. Oh, no, it is Vox. Wait, no, she's Vox. Okay. I'll stop. <laughs> I was going to say... Fox looks great. How are you going to say she looks worse? Oof. Shit's about to get real. Oh, is this go is this is this going to go down? Cuz that dude is terrifying. Attack like a dragon attack to bring us all together, eh? Thank you everyone <laughs> of course. for making the journey in. Please allow me to introduce our dining party. We have Arbiter Dualajun, Master of Law. Look at all these like Percy. There's so many different types of creatures here, like races. I don't know who any of them are. He said the Briarwoods took everything. The Briarwoods. We cannot be caught unprepared again. Yeah, it'd be nice if Percy gave them some info. Nope, stop. That's a that's a table foul. Percy, I say you just walk over to the Briar Woods, say hello to Break the Ice, then punch him in the face. <laughs> I like it. Grog, no. No. Oh. I don't hate Grog's idea. <laughs> we have to wait. Give Vax a chance to gather some intel. Oh, nice. That's sneaky. I like it. Like I said, they're very talented. This dude looks so tired. Here we go. Yo, what? What the bloody hell? Fucking Come on. What is that? What? What magic was that? <laughs> that was cool. I must confess, hmm. I was rather curious whether you would come. A messenger. Is that red return. cabbage? In fact, I've heard dark rumors about Whitestone. They say hmm. no one travels in or out of your lands. Lies. Please cook that more. Meals. If no one left Whitestone, would we be sitting before you, Sovereign? Hmm. Perhaps. I wonder what she's or capable I of. Be forced to send a garrison of troops she has to, to be. City. You won't need oh. to do that. She, she has to be. Okay, they, they are not pleasant. You are right. There's no need. They, they In are. Fact, Whitestone needs to be protected. Oh, they're frightening. Yes, Whitestone's independence is not to be challenged. Huh. <laughs> She's like, am I the only one who saw that? Oh, jeez. Oh, they're tension. Have we uh, met before? Oh no. <laughs> Grog. Oh boy. We haven't met. I'm Vexolia. I'm so sorry. What was your name again? Delilah, what an absolute pleasure Delilah. to Delilah, I like Protectors that name. Protectors of the realm. My husband, Silas. Charm. Oh, Silas is horrifying. Uh, those are beautiful beads. Mm. I have a set just like it, you know. Beads? I've never once yeah. seen... No, oh, no! Yeah. <laughs> no, <laughs> I instantly knew what he was talking about just because who he is. <laughs>
Dude, that thing is so cool. Oh, there has to be something underneath. Well, this is a nice piece of music. Do they, do they, do they have like music playing during their campaigns on Critical Role? Like, do they actually like? Oh, I don't know how like how much of big of a production Critical Role Critical Role is. Interestingly enough, we're not originally from Whitestone. Of course you're not. Oh. Tell me, have you heard yeah, he's how we became explode. caretakers of Whitestone? Oh no. The official story is that the city was administered by the Dorolo family. Oh no. Until they succumbed to a rare disease. That is not what happened. But I'm afraid the truth is, we concocted that tale to protect their legacy. The sad reality is that the Dorolos abdicated. Uh, they grew bored of ruling. No, you massacred them. The treasury. They abandoned their people oh, to rot. No. Oh. oh, okay. Here we go. Thank you, Sovereign Uriel, but I think we will retire for the night. It was a lovely day. I need to sit up. We especially enjoyed the company. So refined. Do you think they recognize him? Do they think they know who that is? Excuse us for a moment. Because why else would they say it like that? Percival, darling, what did we say about emotions? You don't understand. I was going to say. Help us understand. Yeah, tell your friends. Oh. Briar Ooh, Woods. I like that. They murdered my entire family. Remind me of something out of Sin City. Dude, you need to get out. We got what we came for. Uriel was more pliant than even I anticipated. Mm. So they just wanted to get there to just brainwash and hypnotize the sovereign. The whispered one. The whispered one. Finding the boy was. Uh, so they did recognize him. Okay, thought so. So if he's still alive, Percy, does he still have claim over that land? What is just happened? I'm scared for Vax. Was this the whispered one? Oh no! Oh, uh, beg your pardon. Just turning down your bed. Forgot those little <laughs> pillow mates. These two are terrifying. No. <laughs> You'll stay the chance. Oh gosh, you're handsome. They are. Lost my train of thought. Be right back. Oh, that dude can punch a hole into your chest, and then he could do that. Ahem. Oh no. Ladies and lords, allow that cod piece. Are you kidding me? You oh no. No, like to call no, no. I was gonna say, is this gonna be sexual? Holy, oh, Jesus. I hate everything that's happening. Look uh, oh, no! Is he a vampire? I mean, what, what else was he gonna do? Oh, either towards them or out the window. But he is not safe. Oh, okay. So that's her. Jenga. Vax. We have to move. Oh no. You don't stand a chance, dude. There's no way out tonight, my friend. This guy's more formidable than the dragon. Oh boy. Silas! Delilah! Oh, this is they're out of their league. Would you look at that, dear? It's the pup who survived. Oh, they're out of their league. Step off, <laughs> how, how do you how do you How do you fight these two? How's this happen? Blue Force ain't gonna be it. <laughs> Please save him. 
Oh, thank goodness. Thanks, pickle. <gasps> pickle. Got him right where I wanted him. It's a great nickname. I call my friend Pickle. <laughs> I, I love the movement in the animations and the action sequences. I just love how they move. Ooh, nice shot. Does nothing. <laughs> you, you're right, Pike. You got it. Oh, that thing is awesome. That is a great looking sword. You got a sword. Hmm. Oh, I love how this is animated. I wasn't impressed with the animation initially, but it's growing on me. That is... That is neat. Did that thing just, like... Did he just, like, feed the sword? So, we're not doing terrible, right? No, you're doing awful. This is terrible. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright, best sword ever. Best sword ever. The more contact it makes, the freaking bigger and stronger it gets. That is so cool. What a great idea. Aw. <laughs> I love those two. Go Grog! Get him! Oh no. No! Oh, jeez. No! Oh. <laughs> Balls of steel! Ooh. I'm all about the Grog and Pike friendship. Gods can't help you now. Oh, though, you see his face? Whew, what a save. Yeah, they need to... They need to save face. They can't be seen doing this. Oh! I'll drive, thank you. Well, what about Desmond? Stop them! Come visit us sometime, Percival. Oh Always my god, they're back. so arrogant. They suck. I mean, they're cool as fuck. No! And they're badass, but they suck. Had them! You did not have them. You let them slip away. Oh no, Percy, they tried. I I didn't no. no, what does that no, mean? Please. Is that her power? Him. Get him. Don't kill him, but... Oh, no. Do not kill him. Oh, I love that. That gun's so cool. Start talking. Why were the Briarwoods here? What were they after? I, they were invited, like you. Uh-huh. By Sovereign Uriel. Silas and Delilah have never left the confines of Whitestone. Right, before. yeah. Why here? Why now? He was very surprised to see them. Excuse me? Answer me. Now. What, what is happening? Fuck. Hey, shit, Percy, what are you doing? Please. I'm, I'm only a servant. They, oh! They don't tell me anything. What just happened? What is this side of Percy? Percy, stop! Holy crap! <laughs> I was not expecting this. What is he? You fool. Now your soul is forfeit. Whoa. Halt right there. What is the meaning of this? Guards, arrest Vox Machina. Oh, wow. Go, go. Percy has been like the least interesting character to me through these first two episodes. This has just... He's gone to, like, the top. That was what just happened. Who is he? Yeah, right. Wow! 
Holy crap. Silas and Delilah. Wow. Um, terrifying individuals. They, they, <laughs> that was incredible. That was so cool. Like they're terrifying, but they're badass. They're cool, but they also suck. Uh, like I don't just, they're just incredibly cruel. Like just the way they were talking to Percy and just, but man, that was a really neat episode. Uh, so yeah, we got a lot of insight into Percy, uh, Percy up into this point through first, the first two episodes didn't really know what his deal was. He, he's, he was the, probably the character that I talked about the least when those first two reactions and to get his backstory here and just incredibly tragic, um, entire family just massacred. They, I guess his family was with Whitestone. Um, and for them to just be infiltrated and assassinated like they were, and for him to survive. And just to show that bit of his past tied to the Briarwoods. And, you know, we only got to see Silas and what he could do briefly in, in the end of episode two. But to see Delilah, what she's capable of, she is terrifying. She is dangerous. She's quite powerful. They both are. And but back to Percy, and then they showed that plague doctor mask, and I didn't know what the significance of that was. But he definitely channeled some dark magic there, and just I feel like he just became a totally different person, entirely different person, right before our eyes like that. And he was mentioning about what what did he say? I uh, I can't forget what he said. Like taking your soul, or your soul soul belongs to me. Like I butchering that but what was that that was he like i just said he became like he was at the bottom of someone that i was like not really like feeling but holy crap he's up here now like i want to know more i want to know more um but i i, I enjoy the i enjoyed how i think we got a really good taste in this episode of how close this group is um, they're very supportive of each other. Like there was that moment where Pike and Grog were just really, you know, consoling Percy and really like wanting them, like, we want to know what's going on because we want to know how we could help. Right. And I, I like, I, I love this group of misfits. I already do. Like I'm only three episodes in and I, and I, and I, and I love them. I think they're fantastic. Uh, and to see, uh, you know, and, and Vax doing what he was doing, I there was a part of me that I thought Vax was going to die. <laughs> like, I don't know where this... Obviously, I don't know the story of this campaign, uh, but I honestly thought they were going to kill Vax off right there. Wouldn't that have been something? If they killed a major character three episodes in, that would have been... That, that, that would have... That would have genuinely impressed me if they went that if they went that direction. I thought he was dead, and uh, Pike, Pike, uh, her her powers like is are her powers completely like drawn from that necklace or not? Like I don't know, but she was talking to it like it was like a living thing. Like oh, just so many questions, but so cool, so so cool that. Uh, I don't know if the Briarwoods are are like major are are major adversaries in this series yet. Like I'm not sure. Or are they just kind of something that's off to the side right now? But I think they're gonna be big players moving forward based off what happened there with the sovereign. Like they mentioned, they don't leave Whitestone. And for them to come out and to hypnotize and brainwash the sovereign. You know, they I feel like they're gonna be major players moving forward. I mean, obviously we'll find I'll find out, but very cool. I'm 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 loving this show. This has been such a incredibly pleasant surprise for me in the early goings of 2022 in terms of movies and shows. Never this was never on my radar. Um I saw an ad for it on Twitter and I was like, well, that looks kind of cool. So I, I watched the trailer and I'm like, I'm down. I'm down. I saw Critical Role. I was like, I've heard of Critical Role. 
but I'm down. I'm down to watch this. Uh, the just the adult nature has been the most uh, welcoming thing in this show. But no, this has been really cool. I can't wait to watch more. But yeah, that's all I got for you today. Uh, Legend of Vox Machina. Who would have thought I would be? This will be my early going one of my favorite things of this year so far but yeah that's all i got for you today um if you haven't already please consider subscribing to the channel i appreciate all the subs uh likes comments whatever um you want to do for this video that would be really great and uh yeah that's all i got for you today have a great one folks we'll see you next time so long